The electric blue acara is a rare and beautiful new aquarium fish, but where did they come from? We do. We have customers flocking in for it all the time. They're really, really hyped on it. Um, they use it in a lot of the smaller nano systems because they don't have a lot of room for filtration. And it's really nice and convenient being already in the bag already. The electric blue Acara has only been available in local shops for about a year. Search the internet and you won't find much about them. So I asked Mike Tushinardi, the marketing director at fish wholesaler Seagrist Farms, which is the exclusive distributor of the fish to local stores. He also writes for Tropical Fish Hobbyist magazine. Mike says the fish came in from a supplier in the Far East in early 2013. I took that to mean somewhere in Asia. Mike also says it's not clear if it's a hybrid with another cichlid or another strain of Acara other than the blue, or as Mike put it, simply a very visually appealing morph of the common blue acara. Mike says that breeders spend years developing new strains of fish and they're often reluctant to share their secrets and that appears to be the case here. In my plant at 55, they've exhibited typical blue acara habits. They've not bothered the tetras or even the stray African cichlid that I have in the aquarium, a, a brichardi that pretty much grew up in the tank. They eat everything in sight, and they come to the glass begging as soon as I enter the room. They're clearly the dominant fish in this aquarium. And these electric blue acaras use the entire aquarium, and their constant activity is just a joy to watch. They really make the tank a whole lot better. Now, speaking of which, after about a month in this aquarium, one of the females turned almost white and started defending territory. At first, I thought she was sick, but clearly, uh, when a blue fish gets into breeding colors, it turns white in this case. I haven't been able to see any eggs, but she and one of the males are calling this section of the tank home and appear to be defending some sort of a nest. I don't focus much on breeding of fish, but if they produce fry, these rare and beautiful electric blue acaras might be worth it. I'll let you know. Yeah, they're really thrilled with it, and it's one of the products that we know we have to have a lot of because they're always coming in for it. <laughs> 